Hey, you know the grind don't stop. Let's get it. How's it going, everybody? Welcome to the channel before and after the mix. Thank you so much for coming by. This is gameplay part two. Uh, <laughs> you see my guy right here, uh, Ichiban. Uh, we leveled up a bit. Um, we are level six. A bit is just one level. From the last gameplay, I was level five when I ended the stream. Uh, and I bought him a pair of shoes, a pair of sneakers, as you can see on the screen right there on the right top corner uh, in gear. But we're gonna continue right where we pick, right where we, right where we left off, I should say. I've been going around town looking for fights and stuff like that, you know, so I can level him up. I'm trying to grind already on my end, and I'm sorry about the uh, audio for the game. It doesn't matter what I do on here in the settings. I cannot find a way to lower the audio. Find that sweet, sweet spot where my voice is not fighting with the game audio as I'm commenta commentating during the gameplay which is annoying but i've learned that when i'm fighting it gets louder of course right so i should just keep my mouth shut and don't talk at all uh during the fight scenes and uh and then when they're talking i don't talk or if i have to say something really badly i guess i have to scream like okay i'll use this example right here i'm going these these guys right here these guys right here right. 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 So the yeah. and i'm going to talk good luck here now. so much for coming for hanging out for checking out this gameplay this is yakuza like a dragon Ooh. Ooh, more people to fight i can't i can't i can't help it I can't fight right now i'm gonna be fighting so i can make a lot so i'm not um i am gonna be blinding so i'm not struggling as much Ooh, while i'm playing the uh, story and of course i'm gonna switch things up This is where I need to be right here. Nope, nope, right down here. All right. I like the story already. I went to jail for 18 years. Uh, I got out, find out I was betrayed. This is it, isn't it? Hey, are you supposed to be here? You got any idea what happened to the office that used to be here? Office? This used to be, you know, a girl's bar. What about before that? There was an office here. No, before the bar it was a computer store. Before that it was a maid cafe, and before that, a Filipino bar, I think. But 18 years ago, a, a family had their office here. The Arakawa family? Don't you know what I'm talking about? A family? Not a family, family, a, a Yakuza office, okay? Anyway, I know it was here. That's too far back even for my old bones. <laughs> but I'll be honest with you, I don't see how the Arakawa family could have been holed up in a dinky office like this. Oh, so you do know them? I don't think there's a soul on this side of town who does it. They're a huge, famous family. Really? Finally, some good news. So where are they? I'm looking for them. Ah, <sighs> not sure. In this day and age, Yakuza can't exactly be loud and proud, you know. Especially not hotshots like the Arakawa boys. 
I get it. Okay, thanks. Think you'll find them? Yeah. Well, I'll just ask the old woman at the SIG stand where they're headquartered. She always knows what's going on. Okay, good luck. That's if she's still alive. I mean, he keeps forgetting that he went away for 18 years. Things have changed. <laughs> Let's go ask the old lady in the cigarette shop, but not before I get into this fight down here. I'm always looking on the mini-map for fights, and as soon as I see them, I make my way towards them. There should be a couple guys down here. What? I just saw them. Where'd they go? Ah, oh, that was booty. They ran off. Alright, whatever. Let's, let's follow the arrow so we can go where we need to be right here. Sorry. the old woman oh you mean the previous owner <laughs> she moved back to the countryside a long time ago probably taking it easy in an old folks home by now oh i see hey do you know where the arakawa family office is if, if you're not making a purchase i should help the customer behind you i just want to know where the arakawa office is hey some of us got places to be that's the usual Yes, here you are. 500 yen, please. Just put it on my tab. Wow. People sure have gotten rude since I was gone. How pathetic. You say something? Where'd you learn your manners, huh? Mom raised you in a barn? Jeez. And you're walking around town wearing a Tojo badge? Oh, wait. It's Omi Alliance. So, you're in the know. What family you from? Me? I'm Arakawa. Oh, uh, nice to meet you, brother. Sorry I didn't know you. I'm new. Like hell you are! You're lying, out here with the Omi symbols, faking like you're Arakawa! Wait, you and that crew that visited the old chairman's grave today? Mm hmm? Oh, yeah, there was a big ceremony scheduled. But only the Patriarch and his officers go to stuff like that. Maybe some of their assistants, too, but that's it. Damn, you must be newer than me. Tell me one thing. Who's our patriarch right now? Dude, you living under a rock? Just tell me who it is. It's acting captain of the Omi Alliance, Masumi Arakawa, obviously. Man, you forgot the name of your patriarch? Get your shit together. Hey, you don't order me to do anything. I'm not Omi. Oh, but you just said you were in the Arakawa family. Damn right. And that family is part of the Tojo clan. Tojo clan? You sleep talking, dude? Do I look fucking asleep? No, you don't. But I'm a you to be one of those up. Tojo pests still crawling around. We've got permission from HQ to exterminate them on sight. You Omi are the ones who invaded. This city is Tojo turf. Not anymore. I do Tojo roaches need to die already! Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Where did that battle is going back from? Cool. Oh, he's level 5. Oh, okay. I gotta come correct. I gotta see him with a attack. Check this out! Come on! Charge it up real quick. You know what I mean? He deserved that. You're in it now! Get it! Took it! Yeah, you got it! Oh, my God! Oh, he deserved that big move. You know, he came out here, he's level five. He talking all that shit. Did Arakawa-san really betray the Tojo clan and run to the Yomi? Answer me! Yes! Haniki! That guy's a Tojo loyalist! Get him! What? Get back here! Oh shit. That detective was definitely not lying. See that? Now he knows there's nothing for me here. I need to get the hell out of town. Huh? Oh.
She's eating better. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Ease up in the water, trip, yeah, lady. some of the, these conversations they are good to know though like so you can know where to go what to do next and whatnot <sighs> yep let's go check and again because that i just started the game not a lot of places are opened up to me but as the story progress uh, a lot of places will start opening up to me again. I'm, I'm used to this style of game And some of the areas are so familiar to me like it, it's crazy. I need a damn key Yep, this is definitely something important in there uh, And I see two guys outside on the other side of this. Please don't run. Let me fight you. I need all the experience and money I can Bugs, baby, let's go, let's go. There we go. It's not much, but everything, every, every cent counts. And I run, it looks like I run everywhere I'm going. I'm always running. Always, always running in the game. I see some people right down here. Near the jail. So whenever I'm fighting, I use the uh, surround areas like the uh, um bikes and stuff whatever's around I'll use it Us using my surroundings I need a damn key yep. ah. yeah so the fighting mechanics definitely change in this game the last one the last Yakuza the last few that Yakuza games I would just run up to the person before they even say anything I, I'd already start kicking <laughs> 
Like, I just run like I'm running now, and I, I would do, like, a roundhouse kick or a front kick, and then you know, put their asses down mid-conversation. Nah. for me apparently red suit effed up hair <laughs> sup all right let's do this enough talk let's just, just go ahead and i'll show you guys a little two combos that i have the battle is on cool okay so i'm going after the one with the weapon check this out Yep, I just picked up the bench. Light work, baby. Light work. Damn, you're strong. You know. Yeah. We're gonna remember your face, dick! And I'll forget yours just as quick. I can dick. tell you love your job, but you ought to love being alive more. Else who's gonna take care of that precious camera? A real fist fight between the Omi Alliance and a Tojo clan loyalist! Aw, oh, yeah! These picks are go for a fortune! Thanks, Ichiban! Hey, and hold he up! Runs off. Ah, he broke the camera. That sucks. What the hell are you doing, man? Don't bother that guy. It was your fault anyway. Come on, get out of here. If I see you again, I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. <laughs> Tough words for a guy who just took off screaming. Yeah, you better run, Kamalop. Kamulop? It's a local mascot they made to improve Kamurocho's image. What the hell is a local mascot? Uh, we're gonna be here all day. Remember the internet? It's big now. Use it. Fine. Just tell me what happened to the Arakawa family. And Arakawa-san. You were in that family once upon a time, right? Stop! You gotta know what happened, being the local reporter. I don't believe that our Kawasan was a traitor. It wasn't who he was. You really want to know why Arakawa did what he did? Because I do have the scoop. I'm not a journalist for nothing. So tell me. Spill it. When did you get locked up again? 18 years ago. And Arakawa had a son, right? Yeah, the young master. It used to be my job to escort him. I don't know the details, but he was kind of sickly. Right? Uh huh. Uh, what do you mean, was? Is he better now? He's dead. What? When? Oh, shit. How? Hmm. Would have been about three years after you went into the slammer. As I recall, his condition got worse. There was nothing they could do. Arakawa was pretty fond of him, or so I assume. 
It was more than being fond of him. Arakawa-san would have died for his son. Maybe the loss changed his perspective on things. Nothing worse than burying your own kid. Yeah. I can't imagine how that must have felt. But... I still don't see how that would make him betray the Tojo clan. You don't. Maybe you can't understand, but once you have a child, the rest of your life is over. The kid becomes your life's purpose, you know? So imagine the grief you'd feel if the kid dies. You just keep existing with your life's purpose pulled out from under you. The parents gotta find another reason, any other reason, to keep living. <sighs> Couple that with the fact that Arakawa is a Yakuza. I think maybe his new reason to live became watching the world burn. He wouldn't. Hey, why don't you give me some info now? You really in trouble with the Omi like those thugs said? Yeah. And you shouldn't just be strolling around Kamurocho. You still got business here? If not, I'd get out of town. Huh? I promise, Kasuga! There's nothing left for you in Kamurocho! But... Th then where would I go? I mean... I don't know, dude. I'm just saying the Omi are looking for you. So I'd get out of town if I were you. Don't go home. Do I even have a home? Yeah, the soap land you were born in? That'd be your home, right? Shangri-La. Hey! You're not going there now, are you? Don't do it! I'm telling you, they'll kill you! Kill me? Let him try. And there you have it. I'm a lost cause. Alright. I'm going right to where I'm told not to go. But before I do that, there's a fight down here that's about to happen. So much for coming by for checking out this gameplay. This is Yakuza like a dragon. And I'm trying to hold up. Cool. Okay. For help mid fight. I like that. The man should have no friends by the way. Trying to call for help mid-fight, but no one showed up. He he has no friends. Shit happens. And all of a sudden, there's a lot of people around that wants to fight. Let's do it. Cool. Just reached level seven doing this gameplay. Sorry. Oh, nope, you know what it is. You know what it is. I'm always looking on the mini map. Oh, I wish I could just sneak up and get the hell out of him. Perfect, perfect, perfect. 
This was his um, his biological mother found him, um, left him, abandoned him uh, at this location right here, and this is where he was raised, you know, by prostitutes and showgirls. The owner of the place found him and raised him. Wow, it's trashed. Never thought I'd outlive Shangri La. So, is this the last stop on your tour of Camarocho? <sighs> well, I knew you'd end up here eventually. You again? For real? Unbelievable, isn't it? A neon bright paradise like Camarocho, and here's this dark, rotting husk. What happened here? Do you know? There was a Tojo clan civil war. Some moron drove a dump truck through the place. Well, no one's come near it ever since. Now, it's a den for lowlifes and thugs. Some real messed up dudes living there now. I see. I guess I never realized just how long 18 years really is. That's not the Kamara show you remember. I know that must be shitty. Did you see what they built on Nakamichi Street? What? The new Kamuro police station. Just one more set of prying eyes watching everything in this town. That's because of the 3K plan. Without the Tojo clan throwing their bribes and threats around, the station finally got built. That's why everybody loves our go-getter of a governor. The Kamuro police station is just one of his legacies. <laughs> well, that shit doesn't matter to me anymore. Kasuga. I've been nothing but honest with you. I tried to tell you before. The Tojo clan you know is gone. The Omi Alliance from Kanzai invaded and won. They rule this city now. <sighs> so, do you believe me now? Yes. Then <laughs> we're making good time. Well, you came around faster than I thought. <sighs> I knew you were the kind of guy who has to see shit for himself, and everyone else be damned. So, I had to let you walk around Kamurocho until it all clicked for you. <laughs> and you got there quick. What are you doing? Trying to guess everything I do? Making fun of me along the way? Well, I didn't guess everything. I just knew you'd come here. <sighs> Look, man, once and for all, what the hell do you really want? I want you to help me with my investigation. Huh? Arakawa, your former boss, used the police to crush the Tojo clan. Then he gave Kamurocho to the Omi Alliance on a silver platter. You and I both know you can't buy out the police with just Yakuza pocket change. So my theory is some of that money went directly to Juro Horonouchi, the police commissioner. The police commissioner? Yeah. Then I got a bone to pick with that guy. I'd love to see the son of a bitch fired. Of course, I'm just a driver's ed teacher now, so I don't have a lot of chances to get at him. But one chance I do have is if I go through Masumi Arakawa. And you figure I can help you get to Arakawa-san, is that it? Congrats, you solved the puzzle. I thought you'd be game because, come on, aren't you dying to know why he turned traitor? If you don't agree, why don't you tell me? What are you gonna do now, hmm? I want to see Arakawa-san. It's all I thought about in prison. I just want to see him, talk to him. Well, your information. Tonight, Arakawa is bringing some Omi officers to a big meeting with local patriarchs. Really? That true? Oh, yeah. And we're not talking about a sweet little tea party. No, it's gonna be a show of arms. Arakawa? It's a critical moment. He needs to show his dominance. How do you know all this? I still have my connections from when I was a detective. Had to grease some hands, of course. Go figure. 
Well, where's this meeting gonna be? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. A lot has happened. A lot took place, apparently. Uh, I don't know what he's gonna do next, but I'll be here to help him out. We, we need to level up, though. Oh, look at the mascot. Omni Clan. Check out that Cops. restaurant over there. Hey, on Tower. Oh, that's. Um, oh, have you been there? It's a pretty classy joint. Expensive as hell, though. No, I haven't gone. It's just. Uh, Harkawa san once promised to take me there to eat Peking duck. Wait, I get it. This is Harkawa san trying to contact me. Huh? What are you saying? It can't be a coincidence that the meeting is going down there. At a place that meant something to me and him. Oh, of course it could be a coincidence. Come back down to Earth, kid. There aren't many classy restaurants around here. Period. Stands to reason he picked one of the only ones. Hmm? Screw you. It doesn't even matter. What's important is I can finally talk to him. Okay. First of all, the meeting isn't until tonight. And on top of that, the Omi know you're a Tojo loyalist. If they catch you, then you'll have zero chance of talking to Arakawa. Now, luckily, I have a plan for sneaking in. Unless you wanted to bust through the front door like an idiot. Okay, what kind of plan? That's a surprise I'll save for later. Later? What, we're just gonna wait here till they show up? No, I'm sure you have shit to do, just like me. Let's split up and meet back here tonight. Here. Take this with you. What is this? A smartphone. I assume you've seen one before? No, no. not really. How do you use it? Why do they make phones so damn complicated? Got the smartphone, baby. You'll figure it out. Just make sure to pick up when I call you. Whatever. How do I pick up? That's <laughs> Okay, smartphone. <laughs> you can now select smartphone from the pause menu. This will allow you to check your mail, take pictures, and call a taxi. More smartphone functions will be added as you progress through the story. Awesome. Okay, so remember, we're meeting in this part of Theater Square tonight. Till then, keep a low profile, will you? Oh, I'm gonna I'm go out and fight. I'm gonna go and try and level up. Like it, uh, never get lost again. The minimap displayed. Uh, yeah, I know that. There's always the pawn shop. You can sell everything except for valuables at pawn shops. Good to know. Enemies that cut you off. Oh. Ah, they didn't give me the option to like explore the town during the day. I guess it's, you know, it's, it's all good though. All right, I got my destination. Before I go though, let me pull up the smartphone. 29 messages already. Battle tips, gearing up. All right, I'll, I'll go through all that on my own, on my own time, you know. Online store, uh, hit up a taxi. No, 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 we're not, we're not in the online store. All right, that's good. Let's stay focused. Let's not get distracted. Oh, there's a fight coming right now. See some goons. Some street bugs. Cool. Oh, he's got to be out of here. He has friends, you guys. He has friends. But I'm all asleep, though. That's how you do it! Close to level 7. Excuse me. Oh, there was another fight. Come on. He only had no friends. Ah, oh, he does. He had one friend and they just showed up. Keep them combo, son. I'm gonna level up. 
I need to fight stronger people. Excuse me. Here we are. Great. Dachi son's not even here. And I'm sure this is where we're supposed to meet. You really should just sell that business pronto. Don't be sad. Remember what I said? You deal with business the way you do with fish and women. Catch, then release. Take pride in the catch, but then set them free. Any sporting fisherman can tell you that. Okay. Really? You want me back at the office? I hope you're joking. I pay you generously to deal with this nonsense. The whole idea behind bringing you on was so that I could enjoy my nights off. Ciao! Wow. Tip. Hey, sorry to bother you when you're busy. What? You seen a burly looking guy in a blue coat around here? A burly looking guy? Sorry, my friend. Myself, I only pay attention to the ladies. Sure, yes. Why don't you simply call this person? Is his phone dead? Oh, that's right. He gave me a smartphone to call him on. Uh, wait. How do you call someone on this thing? There's no buttons. Oh, a bit behind the times, aren't you? Hey, here, allow me. You'll show me? I'll make you the smartest of smartphone users. Hey, there he is! You're not gonna weasel out of it this time, asshole. Shit! The Yomi found me! Go gotta you cravat wearing fuckwad. When are you gonna do right by us? And who are you, might I ask? You don't remember us? You sold us that shit property! Ah, that Yakuza, weren't you? The one who bought the deed for a most successful girls bar. Successful, my ass! It barely makes any money! You need to make this right, you shyster! Ah, now that is strange. It certainly had a high profit margin while I was running it. The joint's in the red every month! Girls keep quitting, not enough customers. I can't even pay the electric bill! <laughs> I dare say you'll have to become better at managing a business. Fuck you say? Uh, this is a crap business when you pawned it off on me. You better buy it back now! <laughs> you are a funny guy. Asshole. Do you even realize you're mocking the Omi Alliance? Give it a rest, you jerk. Say what? This guy was about to teach me to use a smartphone. I get you got business with him, but get in line. You get in line! Hey, wait just a second. That ugly red suit, and that scruffy-ass hair! My suit's not ugly. Yeah? Remember what Anaki said? How there was a Tojo loyalist around here? Supposed to look just like this guy, down to the moppy hair! Sick asshole. Enough about my hair! Ah, so you're an aggressive type yourself, huh? Something like that. Why don't you stand back, Mr. Nikogata? This is about to get ugly. I can see that. Will you be fine handling this by yourself? Hell yeah. And you can repay me in smartphone lessons. Sound good? <laughs> Very good. Quit your yapping. And if things get ugly, you got nobody to thank but your own hair. Shut up and leave my hair out. Let's do it! Cool. Right, I'm gonna see if I can grab a weapon. Now they're level two. Well, this one. Oh, he's level five. Okay. Check this out. Come on now. I think I just leveled up. Nice. Ranked up, baby.
that's how you do it. <laughs> that looks painful. So, in all honesty, did you sell them a crappy business or not? I certainly did not. It was raking in millions of yen each month at the time of sale. A wonderful little property. If that's true, why'd you offload it? The riffraff you just beat down were insisting on protection money. <laughs> I didn't want their protection. We were only asking for a measly hundred thou a month, man. You wouldn't even make a dent in what you were pulling in. Yes, I recall it being something like that. So you know what I told them? If you think it's so easy, why don't you try running it? And you sold it to him just to make a point? You bet I did. I, I mean, can you believe their arrogance? A measly hundred thou? I have a number of businesses, and yes, they do bring in hundreds of millions of yen per month. But the reason for that is I know the value of money. It's very difficult for a small business to make a hundred thou. Ah, so you wanted them to learn just how much work goes into it. Exactly. And I believe now they have definitely learned. Businesses are like women. You think having one will be so glamorous, but there's some upkeep involved. You Facts. need strategy, you need passion, and you need to work your ass off to make her happy. Facts. So, are you gonna do what it takes to make that bar successful? Fuck that, I'm done sinking money into that bottomless pit. Fine, I'll buy it back from you, but for half of what you paid me. Fuck you! But fine, take it, I don't care anymore. I'll buy it. <sighs> I don't believe I caught your name. Kasuga. Ichiban Kasuga. Ichiban? That means number one, doesn't it? <laughs> That's a lot to live up to, but you certainly did that tonight. Thanks for your help. Sure thing. And, uh, speaking of help... Yes. You want to learn how to work a smartphone, correct? <laughs> Don't worry, I didn't forget. Let's get to it. Where's your phone? Wow. I actually feel like I can make use of this thing now. Thanks, Nick. <laughs> You're welcome. Mayhaps we should keep in touch. When I meet interesting people, I like to think there's a reason why. We can be pen pals. Uh, if you want. But I got kind of a history, in case you couldn't tell. I got out of prison today. <laughs> that, that sort of thing doesn't bother me. Well, you should probably know. I was charged with murder. Is that so? Oh my, you are interesting. <laughs> and rather blunt, too. You've got more honesty than sense. But I like that. Oh yeah? You might say I associate with people who have, well, all kinds of baggage. Many of them are caring much more than you. No kidding. I'm starting to think you're shadier than the guys I knew in prison. <laughs> Bad news for me if that's what a felon thinks. One point for Mr. Number One. Guess so. Well, see you around, Ichiban. You're not gonna just randomly call me or anything, are you? I just might. You'll find me to be a very persistent man. Hey there, Kasuga. Who is that guy? Well, my first pen pal, I guess. Huh? Hey, what took you so long anyway, man? You're the one who set this whole thing up. Oh, I was hungry, so I went and got a beef ball. I ordered an extra large one and Ooh. it was a struggle. <laughs> Guess I'm getting old. Aren't we all? But here I am, about to sneak into a high-level Omi meeting. Man. Well, hope you're ready. Let's go. I, I'm, I'm ready. Hope everybody's ready. And quick shout out to everybody in the house again. Thank you Yo. for coming by. Okay.
Okay. Oh, the sewers. We've used the sewers before in the in the previous series of uh, uh, Yakuza. For real? I like how no one hmm? says anything. <laughs> like the yeah. civilians. I did not see this coming. Okay. Uh, well, he's Sup? part of the party now. I have, I can control him, which is nice. Tell him who to hit during fights and so on and so forth. <laughs> All right, that's enough small talk. Yo. <sighs> All right, we're still in chapter two of Bloody Reunion, and we just entered the sewers. Typical sewers, Will this place right? even take us anywhere? Yeah. Should be a lot building. of fighting in here. Careful, Never yeah, know what kind which is of fine. But I'm going to end the stream right here. Thank you so much for coming, for checking this out. This is Yakuza like a dragon. <laughs> and I'm having fun with it. You know, uh, I still got a lot to learn. Uh, but I'll, I'll get there eventually. I'll get there. But thank you again for coming by. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Like I said, be safe on your end. And like I always say, you know this grind don't stop. And I'm out.